are now listening to the melodic, hypnotic, and enchanting voice of your girl Giselda. And I'd like to welcome you to the show. Motherfuckers be having too much going on. I'm not finna wear that mask. Damn, it's hot. How is human and hot as hell out here? Hey, yeah, I'm going to drop it. I gotta go back to the studio this weekend. I got a couple more tracks to put on that um that EP. You know what I'm saying? But we definitely got it coming for you. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, I hope everybody having a blessed and prosperous day. You know what I'm saying? I know I've been missing for a couple of days. I had to sleep that jet lag out, man. That, you know, going through all them time zones. Because I'm um I'm in Panama City Beach, so we are already on Central Standard Time. You feel me? So then I flew through Eastern Time, and then I ended up in Pacific Time. So I'm just, I was really, I had to catch up on my rest for a couple of days. But I think I'm back good now. Uh, we're going to be hitting the road tomorrow get back in the studio or whatever go ahead and finish up that um that ep but um so listen i didn't have a winner this week nobody uh it, nobody registered to win the uh 200 pair of ugg slippers that i was giving away so um i haven't decided what i'm gonna do this upcoming week for the giveaway but i will probably decide tonight and announce it tomorrow so um if y'all didn't catch the last two giveaways which was um a free well the first one was like a six hundred dollar package for a free business registration and let me mention um my homegirl keisha smooth y'all follow keisha she's the one who actually won that business registration um and i'm i'm gonna be paying for her business to get registered i'm gonna pay for her um certificate of taxes for this year and uh, i will be doing all the paperwork and registering her entity for her so that is what she won just by you know entering the contest real simple rules 
But hey, listen, if you can't do the minimum, you know what I'm saying, simple rules to enter a contest for a free business registration, then don't even worry about having a business because you, you probably don't have the ambition or the commitment that it's going to take to be able to run and stick to it because it's not for the weak, you know what I'm saying, or the faint-hearted. So last week's uh, giveaway was a $200 pair of slippers. Nobody entered that contest, which is cool. I probably just, I don't know, put them on eBay or something and sell them. Um, you know, I ain't tripping about, about no extra cash in my pocket. So listen, this week we're going to have another giveaway. We're going to see how many people enter the contest. If you don't, cool. If you do, cool. Um, if not, in the meantime, between time, go on over to my YouTube channel at She Boss Talks. That's S-H-I-I-B-O-S-S-T-A-L-K-Z, all right? I will be um, dropping little snippets of the like video clips and stuff over there on the channel, too, for the album. But we also got the um, commercial snippets for the boutique, Gotti Goddessy, all right? So I hope y'all are ready to shop because... The website will be launching soon. Um, if you see anything that you like that's being displayed on the page or the story, you can always DM for info. We are taking sales. We accept cash, PayPal, and Zelle at the current moment. But you will be able to um, purchase securely through PayPal once the website is up and running. Okay. And um, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. I got something. To, I'm going to go live later on today, man. We're going to have a talk because... I, it's still a lot of controversy going on behind this. This uh, I'm gonna say the the I'm not I don't even know what to call it. I don't even want to call it nothing. Let's just say the pandemic. You know what I'm saying? It's it's heavy. It's still going on. I know round two is coming up. Everybody's in in all in the uproar about the round two of the um the COVID and the round two of the stimulus. <laughs> they hit them. They hitting us with another two for one <laughs> for the winter. I don't know what I don't know what's going on, man. But in any event. We gonna we gonna talk about it tonight, okay? So listen, y'all tune in for that, and um, I want to get y'all input of y'all, you know, what I'm saying feedback on what y'all think about it. I, you know, I just really hate the mask. I don't get me wrong, I started this mask business a year ago before this even came about, so I didn't know anything about this. But my masks are for fashion, okay? I do not believe that any mask that you wear, I don't care if it's an N95, uh, I don't care if it's one of these masks, I don't care if it's a hospital mask. I don't believe if the road is floating around in the air and you walk into a section of somebody that was just in that area five seconds prior to you, then it's still going to be there. Okay, so the mask is not going to protect you. If you're going to get it, you're going to get it. Um, yes, I do think that it may lower and lessen the chances of you getting sick from people who are sick around you. But I do not believe that it's floating through the air and these masks are protecting us from it. Okay, I just think it's more to it. Um, I know that the, the social distancing has nothing to do with you standing six feet apart from somebody once again because if you're six feet in front of me or you're six feet behind me and I got the Rona and I'm walking in front of you, if you're walking directly behind me and you walk up through the same spot that I walk up in less than two minutes, it, it, me standing six feet apart from you is not protecting you. <laughs> hey, what the fuck are they talking about? It's the dumbest shit ever. So you already know it's another agenda. I don't know why they want us to wear these masks and keep ourselves covered up. Um, but in any event, I intend to get to the bottom of it because it's always something, whatever they usually distract us with is usually something else going on behind the scenes. So, um, we're going to talk about that later on. I want to see what y'all, uh, feelings is about these mandatory mass ordinance and things of that nature. All right. So in any event, like I said, I hope everybody's having a blessed and prosperous day. Once again, this is your girl, Giselle Deshebaos. If y'all like those earrings, hit me up. Yes, I did make these. They're flex, they're flex earrings, y'all, so they can do some different stuff. They go all different kind of ways, and you know what I'm saying? You can straighten them out of your curl them out. I just like mine curled up like a little S shape or whatever, so I just be playing around with um with them. But, yes, these are my own original ideas and creation. Let me just put that out there because I be having folks trying to, you know what I'm saying, steal the swag and shit, but um, ain't nobody else making these flex rings, all right? So this is me right here. All right, so boom, that's what I got for y'all today. As always, I speak nothing but infinite blessings and abundance on your life, your wealth, your health, your community, your love, your existence, okay? Uh, go encourage somebody, help somebody, man. Speak positive to somebody. Just influence and motivate them because you never know what a uh, lending their ear, you know what I'm saying, or just like support, being, being supportive of somebody else. Even if you're not feeling it, it may make you feel better. And trust and believe you'll reap abundant um, and infinite blessings, okay, in return. That's how the universe works. Whatever you put out is what you get back. Trust me, I'm speaking from experience, all right? I help a lot of people. I give a lot of love out, and I don't get nothing but that in return. So it feels good, you know what I'm saying? And I just want to share that with y'all just in case y'all know. So if y'all experiencing a lot of, you know, hate, jealousy, enviousness, and stuff like that, it may be because you're putting that out or you're putting that energy out. So you want, might want to check yourself before you wreck yourself. 
instead of, you know, blaming others for things like that. And I'm not, you know, no shade or no finger point, but this is sometimes we don't think about what are we doing to really contribute to the situation, whether it's positive or negative, okay? So sometimes we just got to self-check, you know what I'm saying, in the moment and, and see what you're doing. So you're, you're, you're assisting the situation to see if you're entertaining it or instigating it and then figure out what you can do to remove yourself from the situation and to diffuse any type of negative energy that may come from that, okay? All right, so boom. There you go. I ain't going to appreciate y'all that. I love y'all. Thank y'all for y'all support and encouragement. All right. Thank y'all for y'all feedback and y'all love. And I will see y'all later.